Hello everyone, hello, welcome or welcome back to the channel. My name is Nisi and this is Paid to Talk. On today's video, I wanted to talk about three lessons that I got from Nick Avocado Transformation. If you don't know what I'm talking about, you're probably asleep. <laughs> YouTube streets are hot right now. Um, I don't know if you guys know who Nick Avocado is. Um, he's a famous YouTuber. Um, he started a couple, he started years ago um, and he was a vegan uh, YouTuber and then he transitioned to like mug bangs and stuff like that. Y'all, I am shook, okay? Nick Avocado lost like 250 pounds. I am so freaking proud of that man. Um, I was never like, I'm not gonna lie to you, I was never like a hardcore follower of his, but I do follow him. I would check on his page sometimes just to see what's going on because y'all, it seems like he was eating himself to death, right? And like 90% of the comments were like negative comments. People were saying, maybe 80, maybe 80% 80 of the comments were negative. People were saying, keep eating, you fatty. Um, I hope you get a heart attack or just keep eating, keep doing this stuff. And y'all, I woke up today and I went on YouTube and I went on his page and I see that he lost all of that weight. Like, I'm so proud of Nick. And just seeing his transformation really made me think like three lessons that I, I picked, I, three lessons I learned from his transformation. The first lesson is always be two steps ahead. That's what he called the video, always two steps ahead. I'll link the video below. Uh, how this man disappeared for like seven months, seven, okay? He disappeared for seven months. He popped up yesterday and this man is 250 pounds lighter. Like, oh my God, I've never been so happy for a stranger because like, especially someone that struggles with weight, like losing weight is so hard. Oh, I don't want to say it's hard, but you know, it's challenging. Same thing, I guess. But you know, I don't want to speak that as an affirmation, but losing weight is interesting, you know? And as someone that, that struggles with weight and to see someone else struggle with weight because they're overeating and they're just over consuming um, stuff, bad stuff. So sometimes I would look, I would, I never left a bad comment on his profile. I just usually look and be like, God, I hope he snaps out of this. Like I would, I would look at his channel and watch his mukbangs and be like, I hope he snaps out of this one day because he's killing himself. This man got really big. He was having health issues. A lot of he had a lot of stuff going on. So the first lesson is always be two steps two steps ahead and basically work in silence. This man disappeared for seven months and he was doing his thing and he lost the weight. So proud of him. Uh, lesson number two I learned from Nick's um, transformation is remember that not everyone that's watching you support you, right? This man has over, I think, over three or four billion, million, excuse me, followers. And you would think like, oh my God, you have three million followers or three plus million followers. They all love you. They're all rooting for you. And that's not true. Because if you go through his old videos, you're looking at the comment section. You see what people are saying about him. Like, oh, um, I, hope you, I hope you die or you're not dead yet. It really shows you not everyone that watches you supports you. Okay? They can be watching you. They might not... They might not say anything, but they're watching you. But that doesn't mean they like you. If you can somebody subscribe to you, that doesn't mean they support you. In his case, because sometimes, you know, I subscribe to channels that I like and people that I care about. But sometimes people will subscribe to you just to keep an eye out on you to see, oh, she's still alive. How is she doing? Is she doing bad? Is her life falling apart? So there's a lot of lurkers. And in Nick's case, that's what I noticed. Because not all of his subscribers are supportive. Not all of them wanted him to lose weight. Some of them were telling him to eat more, do more bug bang, mug bangs, excuse me. And the last lesson is be kind. Um, because, you know, you never know what someone is going through. You never know what someone is going through. Apparently, I think this was a social experiment. Um, that's what he says. He said it was a social experiment and it was a very long one. I think it was like five years plus. Just to show you the, the true colors of human. A lot of people are not kind. A lot of people are not good people. They think they can sit behind a computer and say nasty things to someone else and things like, oh, it's just words. It's not going to affect them. And Nick, if you ever see this video, I'm so I'm super proud of you, dude. I hope you keep it going. Uh, don't gain all that weight back. And it should also make you analyze and see that your, a lot of your followers do not want the best for you. And, and that is sad. I'm not quite sure how he's dealing with, you know, all of this because he came back and the video was a little different. Um, he's usually like over the top. And like, if you've watched Nick Avocado, you know, he's always over the top and very dramatic. And this video, y'all, he came out like a villain. He came out like he was reading a story. He was reading a page from uh, Robert's Green Book. Very mysterious, very like, 
I'm so disappointed in y'all. Very like, here I am. You guys are gonna feel <laughs> my wrath. Like, I don't know y'all. I don't know. Maybe I'm just looking too too deep into it, but y'all, Nick Avocado done lost the weight. Like, I don't know what else to say. That's all I need to say, child. Nick done lost the weight. Nick, I'm so proud of you, y'all. If you are on a weight loss journey, keep on going. Don't give up. It is losing weight is a little ghetto. Let's keep it real. But keep on going. And anyways, y'all, I'm shook. I'm shocked. I'm surprised. Nick done surprised us. And that should be motivation, okay? That should be motivation for all of us that are trying to lose weight or better ourselves with other, you know, other things in our life. Nick took seven months. He disappeared. He pre-recorded videos. And then he lost weight in secret. And then he revealed himself to us. Like, I don't know. If you're not motivated by his trans transformation, thanks for watching. Deuce.